points. I think Anna van der Bos is better, so we have to wait how the race is. Yeah, the ladies uh, just started. 31 laps to go now, and the bell will ring on 29, and then every lap points. So we have two laps of warm up, and as you see, the skaters are going slow, so they want to warm up slowly. You don't see this in the senior men, for example. And then oh, and we almost the have a crash already. They all they always go fast, yeah. and now the first skater is just cruising. Yeah. And waiting for the first bell. And because they are going uh, this pace, you see a lot of fighting as well. We see now on the outside the Colombian girls moving up. 30 laps to go. Why is there a lot of fighting when the pace is slow? Well, everybody can follow and everybody wants to be in a good position. So even the girls who will have uh, not the speed to... Uh, be there till the end. They want to try to be to get points now in the beginning. So the Colombians are making clear what they want. They want to take the first points, so they're in the lead now, and they go to the first bell. Yeah, we see there with number 30, Maria Renteria. But it's number 80 from South Korea is in the lead now. She wants to take the first points. Young Seo Na. She has a gap of three meters. Yeah, and she stops a little bit of skating before the corner, and now she will accelerate into the corner and try to take the first two points. And I think she will get the first two points. Yes, she got the first two points. Number 80, Young Seo Na from Korea. Yeah, and, and Pinson from Colombia took the one point. Yeah, so it's right away from the start, it's clear. The Colombians will go for Pinson because her teammate gave her that one point. Yeah, and we see now Andrea Lopfankova in front with a goal from Ecuador, Angie Lancheros. Yeah, the strong skater from Czech Republic takes one point and two points for the skater from Ecuador. So from now on, every lap there are two and one point. So there are a lot of points. And it's still the skater from Ecuador who's in the lead. But the Colombian skater goes around now and she will try... Oh, quick crash! Oh, she crashed in first, second position. Wow. Oh, and the Colombian skater didn't crash. She almost crashed, but she takes the two points and the skater from Ecuador is down and is in the back of the pack now. Actually, she's not in the pack anymore. Oh, and here we see it again. What happens? Oh, with his with her right skate, he hits the Colombian girl. Oh, and Anna van der Bos almost crashed. So we see now again the Colombian skater in the front going into the corner. And the girl from Ecuador will try to come back, but this will be very hard because the pace in the peloton is so high. And in the meantime, we saw Fe Carolina Ferreira taking the two points. She saw Diogo Marreiros winning the silver yesterday, and she probably want to do the same. Yeah, for the first time we see Stoddard from the United States in the lead, but there are the two Italians. Oh, and they are going fast. They will take the two and one point, I think. Let's see who takes the two points, and then it's clear the Italians go. It's Eda Paluzzi who took the two points, and Laura Paveri one point. So in the, in the senior category, and also with the juniors men, you always see the skaters who get points and get a gap, keep skating, and try two other points. With the junior ladies, stop skating, and there we see the Colombian girls again. Yeah, the two Colombian skaters are in the lead, and I will think Pinkson will get two points again. Yes, he does. Number 33. So they both got three points now. No, I think Pinkson has four points. No, there's three points. You're right. The girl from Ecuador who crashed and two points. She will be eliminated now. Lancheros from Ecuador is out of the race. Yeah, and for the first time we see the French girl 
She takes the first two points. Marie Dupuy from France. Pinson took another point. She's leading now with four points. So when you see the Dutch girls in third and eighth position, it's Bente Kerkhoff in the third position. Now she's not the best sprinter, so I don't think she will get points here, but maybe she tries to go on a break after this sprint. We have to see. Who took it? The girl from Hungary or the girl from Portugal? It was Huniani from uh, Hungary. Yes, yeah, Huniani. I asked the Hungarian team this morning. Are you a daughter of the famous skater Emeza Hundiari? But she's not. So again, there are the two Colombians and they smarter. The second skater stops. So these are easy points for Pinzon. And she has seven points now. No, six points now. The other girl got four points now. And we saw Ben Tekerkov leading the pack, but she didn't want to close it. Bente Kerkhoff is still in the pack, she looks good, but she, she just waits till the other skaters get tired and then she probably wants to try to get in a breakaway. That's my prediction. And we, we hope it, of course. And Dupuy is taking two points, she got four points now. Five for Rodriguez from Colombia. And we see another time the two Italian girls in front now with Pellucci and Peveri. Yeah, when the Italian take points and the Colombian take points, they always do this together, huh? Eh? Yeah. Almost all the time they take two and one point. And Stoddard is always near the front, but does not have a point yet, I think. Yes, yeah, Stoddard oh. took one point so far. And now she two, took points. two points. And Apaluzzi one point. So when they stop skating again, so we will see other names, I think, and there is Fang. I mentioned her just before the race, she is strong, and she will try to go in a breakaway, just as she did this morning in the heat. And they already have a gap. The points. They already have a gap of 20 meters now, and we yeah. see the Colombians in the re-attack. Do they keep skating? No, they yes, stop. the Mexican girl wants to go. It's Iriaguez Ramirez. So Fang took the two points, Ramirez one point. So and Ramirez wants to go for two more points, but there are the Colombians. Can they catch them just before the points, or will the first two skaters get the points? I think one yes. Colombian skater is there. Oh, and the Chinese, no, it's two points for Rodriguez from Colombia. She got seven points now, and Ramirez took one point and the South Korean girls on the outside and France on the inside the Colombians back in the peloton at place nine so from France Marie Depuy and Honorio Barro are in the lead now and Barro will get the two points in front of Depuy Depuy got five points now Barro took her first points oh it's the other way around so, and Ben Tekerkov and Anna van der Bos are still waiting. I They're waiting they a long time and we see the girl from Venezuela moving on the outside now with a lot of speed. Yeah, but still 14 laps to go, so if you're getting in the breakaway, you can get a lot of points still. So well, they keep skating. They have a big gap and they stop skating again. It's another time Young Seo now who took the first two points. She got four points now and Jimenez from Venezuela took the one point. So that's a skater from Japan. Yeah, Japan in first position now, followed by Peveri from Italy. Peveri is taking the two points. She got three points now. So it's still close to each other. But the Tagahagi Colombian, from Japan with one point. The Colombians are in the lead with seven and six points, followed by Depuy and Na from South Korea. Uh, the leader in this race got seven points now. When we will see... Ah, there is Anna van der Bos. I was just waiting for the Dutch girls, but they are here now in front. 
Dupuis is taking the first points, first two points. Anna van der Bos one point. Dupuis got seven points now. We so see. It's also Benzikakov in the front of the race. She is still waiting. Maybe it's a tactic to go for Anna, but one point is not enough. So we see for the first time the German girl up front. Angelina Otto from Germany in front now, but she's passed by Stoddard and Paluzzi. Paluzzi four points, Stoddard five now. Leading in this race, Rodriguez from Colombia and Dupuy from France. They both got seven points so far. There is Ben Tekerkov for the first time. She is leading in this race. And can the Dutch girl get two points? Or will the German skater pass her on the finishing straight? She's leaving a gap on the inside. No. Oh. Also couldn't pass. Stoddard took two other points. And she is also in the lead now with seven points. Both of the Dutch girls got one point. And we see Carolina Ferreira from Portugal again. She took three points so far. She's followed by Peveri from Italy. And Peveri took also three points so far. Yeah, so we see the, a little gap between Bente and Anna. I think Peveri took two points in front of Ferreira. Yeah, the girl from Portugal looks strong. She didn't skate that good on the track, but on the road, she seems to be better. And there are the two Colombian skaters. They're going really fast. They will try to get a few more points. They're still in the lead. So who will take the two points? They both have seven points to this part of the race. Yeah, and the no, other. No, no, no. Pinson got six. She got eight now. And also Rodriguez took one point. They both got eight points now. Yeah, you're right. They Puy and Stoddard have seven points. So it's really close. Really close with seven laps to go. Seven laps to go till the finish. And the Colombian skaters are leading. And the Puy is also in this group behind the girl from South Korea. But where are the Dutch girls? And where is Stoddard? I Ooh. think the Korean the girl too, might took the points. Number 81, she didn't have points so far. It's Yoon, Sola Yoon from Korea with two points. And Rodriguez took one point from Colombia. Yeah, it's Fang from China who closes the gap. But the next points will go to the skaters from Colombia. And I think Depuy is there. Depuy will try to get one point or maybe two points. Oh, this is going to be, no, the Colombian skaters first and second. Yeah, it's two points for Pinson. She's on 10 now, and also Rodriguez, 10 points now. Then we see on the inside Lokvakova from Czech Republic again. With the Colombian skaters. They're looking really strong. They will try to get at least one more point, or maybe the two points on the finish. Yeah, it's yeah, Colombia. Rodriguez takes two points. So I'm still waiting for a big attack from for the Dutch girls. Can Ben Tekerkov take more points? Does he have does he have some energy left? Or will it be the Colombians who can do this till the finish? Yeah, we see a lot of girls with the hands on the knees now. The leading this race is Rodriguez from Colombia with 12 points. She take another one point now. So Pinson with 12 points in second position. Rodriguez with 30 points in first position. Yeah, there goes Fang. Fang from China. He was great in the heat. He took a lot of points. But till so, so far, she only has, I think, one point. So she will try to get a few more. Followed by Stoddard. Who took seven points so far. Yeah, and two more points for Stoddard brings her in third position behind the Colombian skaters. And there's Anna van der Bos. The Dutch girl has only one point. So we'll try to get a few more points. Only two laps to go. Yeah, followed by Eda Paluzzi and Laura Peveri from Italy. Peveri took five points so far. Paluzzi four. Anna van der Bos only took one. Paluzzi now with six points. 
Anna van der Bos, two points so far in this race. And only two laps to go. And there ben goes Bente Kerkhoff. There goes Bente Kerkhoff. When she comes through the finish, there's only one lap to go. She has a small gap, but the friends go see it and try to chase her down. Ooh, and the French girls stop skating. They pre will try to close the gap, but it looks like Bente Kerkhoff has a nice gap. Uh, unfortunately, she can't make it to the podium anymore because she can get maximum of six points. But the Puy can. She got eight points now, and if she wins this sprint, she will become third. So the Colombians will win this race, but can they pre get third? Started this in third position now. So they pre, they pre will win three points, I guess. Oh, the, you know, the Italian skater is second position. Yeah, so Dupuis they took a medal. Yeah, bronze for Marie Dupuis. And the world title will go to Rodriguez, who took one point in the last sprint. She is the winner of the gold medal with four.